Candace, a week ago we learned she was missing. Tracy Epps, a devoted grandmother, has disappeared. Her last known address, a West End hotel. Also a week ago, Richmond police say her husband pointed a gun at officers. They shot him to death in the Fulton area of the city, which is the East End, leaving many to wonder, could the cases be connected? What happened to 56-year-old Tracy Epps? Crime Insider sources say she was staying at this West End hotel, and detectives do have evidence from a video surveillance system that raises questions about her well-being. We have reached out to her on Facebook. Um, I've reached out to her on text. I've called, and it just says her phone's off. Elizabeth Pullen is a longtime friend. She says Tracy not reaching out to any of her friends is out of character. And she prays that Tracy, a devoted grandmother, is okay. She worked very hard. Yeah. She worked for Owens and Minor for years. And she worked hard. She came to see me all the time. <clears throat> a very independent person. Sources tell me police were looking to locate Tracy Epps after her husband was involved in a shooting in the city's East End. Police say Elsie Epps was agitated when officers arrived on Garber Street last Sunday night. Police say he pointed a gun at two officers and they returned fire, killing him. My sources say detectives believe they found footage of Elsie prior to the deadly shooting. He was wheeling a luggage cart in the parking lot of the hotel where Tracy was staying, and she hasn't been seen since. We don't want to stop looking. We don't want to stop. We just want her found. And Rico police detectives are working with detectives from the city and also family members of Tracy's to locate the missing woman.